from Indy's streaming news leader. This is a WRTV update. And I'm Lauren Casey with your latest headlines. Lawrence police say that a young man has died following a late night shooting. This all happened on Birmingham Drive near East 46th Street and German Church Road. Two people ran from the scene. Investigators are working to find witnesses. Police have not released the age of the victim. And now former teacher facing criminal charges after she allegedly failed to report a fight between two students on a playground. According to court documents, this happened at Guyon Creek Elementary back in February. Records show that during the fight, one student picked up the other and slammed them on their head. Court documents say the fight was never reported to school administrators. That teacher, Rashonda Allen, faces two charges of neglect. This morning, officials at Butler University say they're launching a four year nursing program aimed at helping fill jobs in this growing field. The registered nurse workforce is expected to grow by about 200,000 people by 2031. That's according to the American Association of Colleges of Nursing. Butler officials say that this means there needs to be more programs available for people who are interested in nursing. Let's get a check right now for Wednesday forecast with Todd. Yeah, temperatures a little bit cooler today than the past couple days, Lauren, but still above normal. We'll top off right around 80 degrees here throughout the day today and there will be the chance of storms late this evening. Most of the day features partly cloudy skies, but late tonight and into the overnight hours, slight risk from Indy to Bloomington. It's uh, or a slight risk rather from Seymour uh, to Bedford points to the south. Bloomington to Indy is under the marginal risk and most of the storms will kind of come in waves starting after sunset tonight and then continuing into the overnight hours. This is 430 and maybe even into Thursday morning's commute, but once those storms move through, we're right back into the sunshine. So the daytime hours today will be partly cloudy. We get the storms overnight into tomorrow morning and then for tomorrow, similar to today, morning clouds and afternoon sunshine, Lauren, and a high right around 80. All right, Todd, for more stories and weather you need to know, just download the WRTV mobile app. Thanks for joining us.